Hi, my name is John with Onyx Imaging here in Tulsa, Oklahoma. We are the highest rated printer service center nationwide. If you're interested in learning how to receive free labor on all of your service calls, as well as how to qualify for free printer upgrades, contact us today. We are here for all of your printer and office supply needs. Okay, today we're looking at a Brother HL3180 printer. Um, the customer is complaining that whenever they scan, that they're getting spots and just little defects on their pages. That indicates there's something dirty on the scanner glass. So if you open up the scanner, you see we have our big piece of glass here where we're doing all of our scanning. And more than likely, I mean these things are really prone for tape, ink, whiteout, fingerprints, things like that. Uh, so we want to clean it. The best way to clean it is with a lint-free cloth, your favorite glass cleaner. If you don't have glass cleaner, you can use rubbing alcohol. Um, but the big thing is you never want to apply your glass cleaner directly to the glass. You always want to apply it to your cloth. If you apply the cleaner directly to the glass, you run a high risk of the cleaner actually seeping underneath the glass and causing a lot more problems. So please always apply your cleaner directly to your cloth. And then after that, we're just going to clean, wipe off the scanner bed, get it nice and clean. Man, you're looking, again, looking for anything that could be causing any of those defects. Anything that's blocking the, the scanner itself underneath the glass, between the scanner and the page can give you those little defects. So like any little fingerprints or dirt smudges, ink, tape, anything like that. You just want to make sure it's nice and clean. And once you're happy with the way it looks, I would go ahead and put another sheet of paper on there and run some test copies or scans. Make sure you're happy with the results. If you're still getting little defects, there's probably just something you're missing. I'd go ahead and repeat that process one more time and that should take care of it. Other than that, you should be back up and printing.